back from LA. <laughs> been out on the trail for a few days so I just thought I'd come out take some pictures make some video show you what's happening still lots and lots of snow out here the the dog is chewing on that branch and it hit my camera she's crazy dog anyway here we go the geese are awake Erica came back and let them out I haven't been doing it for a few days She's wanted to do it, and they're her geese, so what can I say? She can do it. Looks like the snow is, I don't know, it's changed out here. It looks different all the time. I can see the geese now, and they're loud. I'm sorry. It's still plenty deep. I'm gonna see if I can get around I probably, you're too loud, guys. My steps are covered with fresh snow and Erica hasn't shoveled them. Oh boy, I don't know, we'll see how this goes. The snow is so deep back there that unless I have a shovel with me, I'm not even going to attempt it. I guess I could try snowshoes. Try, I'd have to go find them up in a closet. Uh, anyway, I'm not gonna try snowshoes today. I, uh, yeah, I'm gonna try a different direction since I got all dressed up in snow pants and all the snow gear to come out. Might as well see if I can actually walk somewhere. Probably not. But I got to come out and see some snow. This is not the average depth of the snow. It's from actually plowing. And the dogs go over this pile, so I thought it should be safe for me to go over. Of course, I weigh more than the dogs do, but Samson's a big boy. I still weigh more than Samson does. <laughs> There's a big step down here. Ah. Oh. I was afraid of falling or dropping my camera. I was going to try to go this way, but let me see if I can zoom in. Looks like Dutch plowed way back there, which means I have no chance to get to my trail. That's a bummer. I didn't get very far today. It's cold. I guess if I want to hike somewhere, I'll have to go someplace because the trails here are just impassable. Not worth fighting to get to them. Getting stuck in the snow up to my waist or higher. The snowpack is pretty deep out there. Then you have the blowing and the drifting snow. I'm just checking out the roof of my house here. And the sun is shining in my eyes. Sort of. Still behind clouds. I mentioned this is a little airport. And it is definitely a little airport. I was like smoking here, that's weird. There's a nice little gift store in here. He's back! Back from LA. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's gone back in to get his luggage. Anyway, it takes a while. Oh yeah, there's a sign posted there, no smoking 20 feet from in entrance. And yet, there are people smoking right outside my car. So now it's going to be all stinky in here. That's very rude. At least the gentleman is walking away. The women, they don't care. They're just standing out there smoking. And I can smell it already. It's already all stinky and I don't like it. I don't like it all stinky out there. Okay. <laughs> Jack thinks I'm crazy. Check out Erica. Oh, she took it off. She took it off. Anyway, we're here. We found a a piggy for Lacey. We're gonna get it and take it home. Except we just noticed it doesn't have a price tag. So Jack's gone to find one with the person. It's intended for dog use only. Keep out of reach of children. Lacey will love it. 
Uh, or she'll hit another place. Uh, Jack fell on with the price tag. Oh, the pink, they'll just ring it up with the purple tag. Yeah. Okay, what else do we need here? Oh, we're at the grocery store. Actually, we're at Walmart. The all purpose store. Late night shopping. Uh, what time is it? It's not that late. Bye.